Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Uh, okay. Uh, meet me again uh, on the fourth video of CQG Desktop. Uh, today we will share you. I will share you about the how to place OCO order. OCO means order uh, one cancel order uh, one cancel others. Okay. Uh, for CQG Desktop, the OCO order is a uh, server side order so you don't need to worry if let's say you lost connection you don't need to worry if let's say you log out from your application you no need to worry that the order won't trigger if let's say won't cancel if let's say you already hit a tp or the other one okay so again uh, my name i'm abrizo abah fulcons uh, read for the notice disclaimer uh, about myself you can Contact me to open a trading account and for more video information hit on please subscribe and get notified if you want to click this bell okay so we go to uh, as usual a demo option okay uh, this is a chart trader there here and then I will add another fish a blank one empty hot order for a uh, one can say other you can only key in in the hybrid order tickets okay this is hybrid order tickets and then i will add another more chart here would be convenient all right okay so it won't show let's say this one is going on high okay so for uh let me close this position first uh, okay and then so and so So I uh, will open a uh, smaller time frames to see spread a bit chart here. Okay, this is five minutes time frames of the uh, crude oil. All right, for to, uh, to do a one cancel other. For example, I'm at a sell position. Okay, I, now I have. Uh, sell position or five lot of uh, sell position for oil and then I want to set a TP I want to set the uh, stop loss okay I need to click on this one okay until this OCO is become orange okay and then you need to choose your stop loss of course the stop loss will be above I will prefer my preferences may be 6824 6824 and then I click I will do a buy stop okay and then it, it have a mark over here and then I will do a TP for example I want my TP to be at 6815 6815 okay, here and then TP will be a limit Let's say I want to change it to this. You see, okay, there's a mark over here for stop loss and for TP. So I click on the submit, it will come out like this confirm to orders by uh, stop, uh, stop loss for the stop limits, and then for the target, the stop limit. That's uh, for the target, is a limit order, okay? So we shall see it if it hits the order will. Cancel the other one, okay? Uh, okay. Okay, you can see here. You can amend also. Okay, amend the order. You can make it go flat or liquidate to you can cancel either one no problem 
Come on, come on, come on. Let's me a man a little bit at 68, 70. Seventy. Seventeen. Okay. So that can be closer to the TP. So we can sell the stop loss. We we will see it live. Okay. Yes. Okay. Now it. Uh, trigger the TP and you can see the order is no longer here okay it will cancel hold on now let me add on all this for you to see okay okay this is this is the remark of A over here is our OC order it will automatically cancel the stop loss all right. Okay. That's it. Thank you.